Well, hello, race fans, and welcome back to another edition of Project Cars with me, your old buddy, Mr. Moose. And we are continuing on with our Project Cars career mode, and we're doing the zero to hero uh, part of this, where we basically, we start at the very bottom and we race our way through the calendar, and hopefully one day we become major 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 success so what are we working on today well the last time we were in the little go-karts today a little something different we are in the cheddar Elm academy and uh we're gonna be racing these little boogers right here and i've got to tell you these are some nasty nasty little cars um i got in and thinking oh man i'm gonna jump in here and record a session on these like i have on all the other cars where i just jump in them get in them ride them and and spank them right oh, i got into these and i wrecked and wrecked and wrecked and wrecked some more and uh finally had to actually break down and tune up the cars a little bit go in there adjust some uh brake pressure some bias uh then i ended up putting some tire pressure in taking some tire pressure out still was wrecking in the walls i uh, checked some springs everything else so i've done a lot of tuning so let me show you what i've done uh we started out and uh i raised up the tire pressure in the front to uh 1.36 bars i lowered the rear tire pressure down to 1.27 hopefully that's keeping the le the rear end grip to the ground and giving me a little more uh steering uh lessen the brake pressure it was like a uh, 90 percent when i got in the car um that was making the rear end come loose as soon as i did something so i have adjusted the brake pressure all the way down to 70 percent i've adjusted the brake bias a little less from the front just almost to center because i don't want again i don't want the back end coming way up on me uh, i haven't messed with traction control or anything else like that uh, the next thing i did was i came in here and uh, I haven't messed with toe angle or steering. I did come in here and crank up the, the spring rates. Uh, they were set at like 34. Uh, I cranked the rear spring up a little bit and then I really, really cranked up the front spring rate and that helped me out a lot. Uh, I dampened the spring rate quite a bit and made it soft and that just made things worse for me. So um, yeah, I don't know. I, I've just tried everything in the world. I haven't really put any bump stop in it uh, to lessen the amount of travel. I've pretty much left it where it's at. So that's what I've done to the car to get it to where I can at least drive it. I mean, I was spinning in every single turn and now I really, really have to just feather the gas coming out of the turns and just be really careful on my uh, braking. But I think I'm in a better spot. So we'll get out here and we'll see what I can get into. And um, yeah, we'll see what happens here. All right, so I've got control of the vehicle now. So really I'm only using four gears in the car. All right, uh, I'm really only using four gears and that's because that's about max that lets me get through when I'm running. So coming up to here, it's the same old thing, heavy on the brake, down through the gears. Uh, I went a little bit too far in that one. And you can hear the rear end broke free on me right there. And uh, yeah, so we're in practice session now, which is good because I got to have a little bit of practice to, you know, get back into the groove on this. All right, right here, I'm going to roll up on the brake, downshift, and the AI just dive bombs underneath me. How they can get under and, and swole up so much, I don't know. All right, so... Now I got to break really hard going into here. If I'm not careful on that turn, I will spin it all the way around. And what I've found is it's best for me just to break really, really hard and we'll up, get down in the second gear and then take that turn. All right, 
at least I'm able to rotate and get through these turns now. I mean, I was ridiculously bad earlier. I probably went through 10 practice sessions to try to get the vehicle to where I could actually drive it. And it's still, I'm right on the edge with it. So, yeah, if I make one mistake, I spin out. No tight turns either. You gotta make everything gradual. I find it easier to get through here if I just stay in third gear and then brake hard coming into here. Oh, I almost turned it up. Uh, I thought the rear end was gonna break free for sure right there. This is the hardest car I have driven um, since I started playing this game, without a doubt. Broke free right there just a little bit. I was hoping I could catch a car in front of me, but I am not running that smooth of a line, so obviously I'm not going real fast. So I left my AI turned up pretty high, you know, where they were the last time and they were pretty competitive the last time. So as hard as these cars are, they're going to kill me. As much as I want to shift into fourth right there, I feel like I'm better to stay in third and get to this corner right here and just break up. Because if I miss this turn, the race is over. I don't expect to do real well on this series because I'm horrible at this car. This car is killing me. I broke free again coming through that turn. Oh, went too wide on that. This car will get away from you in a heartbeat. Can break down shift. Oh, rear and broke free a little bit right there. Oh, 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 there we went again. Carry just a little too much speed into that. behind me I cannot miss a line Feels good. 
Now, that's the first time I've gotten through that corner good. I'm telling you, I don't know if y'all can realize it or not, but I am right on the edge of the rear end just kicking out from me every time I'm in a corner. Shipped it a little early there. That'll hurt me. Man, I hate running that engine. Uh oh, I'm, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble now. There it went. myself there so y'all see what I did carried too much speed into there and it, it bit me uh, second fastest man that's horrible oh I gotta be on the front line if I'm not on the front line I'm in trouble all right well we will uh, we'll move through here and we'll go to qualifying and we'll see what we can do I don't really think there's any changes I can make to the car to make it any better. So I'm just going to have to get in here. Hopefully I can pull a good hot lap, get the pull, and, uh, you know, hopefully that'll work out for go, me. Go, go. If I'm in the pack, I'm, I'm dead. I got no chance. Because as high as I've got them, I can't, I couldn't even make a pass. You know, so. All right, well, we'll get our, get our tires hot on this lap. Ooh, too far out that time. Settle into the groove, hit my marks. Try not to spin her out. Not worry about what the cars around me are doing. Oh. Almost lost it. felt real good going through that corner I'll tell you that much if I could hit that corner like that every time I'd be happy I'd rather give up a little bit of speed going into the corner uh, to make sure that I get through it right and the back end tried to walk away from me right there Oh, no, 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 no. Well, I just hosed that lap. No qualifying lap that time. You cut the corner. Your lap is invalidated. No, 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 bad boy. Oh, well. Actually, isn't this like Britain? So it'd be more like, here, chop. Oh, why don't you cut the corner there? Bravo. So disappointed in you, though, chop. I'm not trying to do a British accent. I'd hose that for good. No, 
Well, Mark Hicks at the fastest lap. I certainly didn't do it because I stunk that one up. I almost feel like I should have changed the gear or two in this because third, fourth gear takes forever to climb. Best sector time. Come on, Moosey. Keep it going. Hit your marks. Make a clean run this time. Ha cha cha. Come on now. Look at Mark Higgs, he's showing off. He got the fastest lap. Can I get it? Can we get it? Can we get it? Ooh, yes, we did it. Oh gosh. Oh, I can wreck from here on out. I'll be happy. Unless old Mark Higgs shows up and goes, oh looky. I've got the fastest lap now. And then I'll be like, ah! Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, yeah. That's what happens if you get on the gas too quick. It's tough coming out of that corner, shifting gears and everything. You know, you're trying to turn and then get the gear shift and all that. It's, ugh. So what I'm doing now is I'm going into fourth and then when I get into this turn, I'm downshifting back into third and just riding third out. I don't like running fourth all the way out like I was. That seems to be working for me. running third I didn't like running third all the way out my bad so yeah if I go out in the third and then run fourth a little bit and then when I gotta slow down slow down and downshift into third Could we possibly overtake somebody? Come on now. Come on, car. Get it going. Yakety, 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 yakety. Come on. Hi ho, green little car. Come on. Let's go. Oh, almost lost it there. Oh, I definitely lost it there. Got a little too excited about possibly catching a car and overtaking, and I ditched it. Got a little cocky there and spun around. Uh oh, uh oh, oh, that wasn't good either.
So, yeah. I don't care. So far, I still have the fastest lap. As long as I don't do that stuff during the race, I'll be all right. All right, shake it off. Forget about it. Fresh lap. Let's go. good went into the wrong place all right refocus these gears sometimes it's hard to feel which one you're going into I'll drop to the lowest gear by accident and And then I'll think I'm going into third and I go into first. Oh, 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 oh. Hello, everybody. How are you? I thought I'd come over here and see you guys. I'd like to get an up close view of this car. Oh well. That was the final lap of qualifying. And I'm just a bouncing through the grass. Yoach! Alright, well. What did we learn? We learn not to get cocky and think that you got it in the bag because just when you do, the horse seal slide out from underneath you. And um, yeah, pretty much did that to me. So, but look at there, Mr. Moose is on top by, wow, like one one hundredth of a second or 100 and yeah, I mean, not much. All right, so. That means I don't have much margin of error against old Mark Higgs. There's a real good chance he's going to kick my butt. All right, well, here we go, guys. It's race time. I don't know if we got two rounds or if this is... Uh, I think there are two rounds. I think we do have the dead start, and then we have the... Um, uh, and then we'll have the, um, the whole kit and caboodle from a rolling start. There's our beautiful little green car. We're starting in the lead. Don't hose the start there, Moosey. Oh, come on, little car. Get to running. Leave them in our dust. Come on, little car. All right, hit your mark here. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, man, I messed that turn up so bad. My lap was invalidated. Track steward said I cut the corner. I got a little love tap there. Have a lead building. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, little car. Don't let me down. Great. Downshift. Come 
Come on, Moosey. Take it home. Take it home. How many laps is this? I think it's a two-lap race. If it's like all the other ones. Oh, man. I'm so nervous right now. I can't believe I get nervous about a stupid racing game. back Moosey. Well, it's more than two laps. it on up get on away from them oh, I got there there clean I'm so nervous. How many more laps is this thing? Oh. Oh, wow, man. Oh. I'm like, my adrenaline is going right now. Whew. All right. Well, that's one down. Pretty good. Now we got to go race another one. All right, so we look at our points that we got for that race. I got 25 points in that one. So yeah, well, whatever. And I got the podium, fastest time. Ah, cha-cha. And let's see, round one race, points, one win, 25 points. And let's see what we got. I guess that was it. All right, well. I'll leave you guys with uh, the actual race results. And uh, well, look, I've got new mail. Somebody's inviting me to some other race probably. Um, yeah, excited to invite you to come race in vintage F1 Lotus class of 86 Master Cup as the driver for our team. So interesting. You get those like after every race, so. All right, guys, well, that's gonna do it for today. I uh, actually thought that was gonna be a little bit longer of a race, but. Um, I thought we'd do actually two of them. I thought we'd do the the cold start and then a rolling start, but um, it looks like just one. So, um, but anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that today. Uh, as always, if you enjoyed it, make sure you give me a thumbs up and um, you know, like the video, share it with your friends, and if you haven't already, subscribe. I do new new videos each and every day. I leave you guys with a replay of the race. Hope you guys enjoy it. Bye.